Now friends, this is the image asset which we are going to learn inside this box, de box decoration cover concept. Now as a third video we are covering image assets. If you want to include images in your Flutter project, then how to do that. Let's just go with our coding part over here. This is the code which we previously developed in our previous videos. We do not require this course. So, so just remove this part and let's just border and radius there. Remove this gradient part. And to include images, first of all, like whom, what kind of mistake you have been take? First of all, if you want to include images, you have to include images folder as, as a same directory as your pubspec file. As you can see, I have one asset folder over here, which is in same directory as a pubspec. Pub Friends, just understand that this pubspec file is not inside this test. It's outside of test means the test and pubspec are on same directory under this Flutter app box decoration project. And you can see the here uh, one asset folder is there and inside this asset folder I have one images flutter.jpg and let me take you to my console so that you can see easily that I am just saving my all projects inside this android studio project. Let just me open it. Now as you can see I have here flutter app box decoration as you open it you can see here the asset folder and the pubspec yml both are on same directory. And you can see inside asset I have one flutter.jpg image. So to use these assets you have to provide same folder as pubspec yml. After that providing you have to include these assets inside this pubspec file. Open this pubspec file. You have to go at bottom where user material design is equal to true provided. Here friends you have to maintain two spaces after this flutter and insert assets colon after that here provide a enter and it will redirect you to the two space after these assets and after that provide one dash this is very important you must have to provide this dash after this just place one space and put this assets folder over here and if you have multiple images inside these assets then you do not have to mention this flutter.jpg but you must have to mention this slash do not forget this slash if you want to use images inside this assets folder and if you do not providing this flutter.jpg and if you have multiple images downside then you just have to provide assets slash now let's just use this asset inside our code to use assets inside our code box decoration provide images to give images to our as you can see we are going to provide image inside this over here to provide image this image of box decoration must required a decoration image or object you must have to provide this decoration image object without it it's going to give you error that on images you can't directly assign to decoration image just remove this null part here we are going to use a set image and in here you have to provide a full path of your image. As you can see inside this flutter app I just directly have a descendant assets and pub spec. So I can directly provide here assets slash inside assets I have flutter.jpg so I can provide flutter.jpg that's it friends. This is all content how you can include images inside your project. Let's just run this code and see what kind of output we are getting. As you can see here, the border rate and border radius are provided upside over here. Here you can see inside the decoration we have color dot blue so that here a color dot blue we are getting. And after that we are just up ascent one image over here. So friends, this is all about the box decoration you also have some more concept which I've written over here as you can see we have a box shape you can directly provide a shape to this rectangle but if you providing any box shape you can't provide this border radius let's just remove this border radius and provide shape and we want to provide box shape as a circle and let's run this code again and just see what kind of output we are getting now as you can see we are getting our output in a circular mode 
and to remove this outside part you just have to decrease the width and height of our container so that you can get a circular and you can put it at a top whenever you are creating some kind of login forms and images which we are going to develop in my next video thank you friends thank you for watching this video this whole series is all about box decoration and which is very important if you don't know about my previous videos then please check it out in my list it will very important if you are developing any kind of flutter application in using box decoration to create a well development content and mobile development content thank you friends thank you for watching this video if you do like my videos on box decoration then do like to my videos and do subscription for more videos on forms and on another widgets and if you like that uh, my videos are important for you or your friends then please do consideration to share this video with your friends thank you friends thank you for watching this videos